Hello boys and girls! Today we are going to review how to compare quantities and numbers. For that, first we need to remember all the numbers from 0 to 20. Let me introduce you to my friend's number blocks. 1 Hello 2 Hello 3 Hello 4 Hello 5 Hello 6 Hello 7 Octoblock 8 Hello 9 Yay! 10 Come on! 11 Welcome, my friends! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. <sighs> I'm a rectangular twelve. I'm ten and two. I make a raise. That's what I do. When I put my blocks in columns and rows, I make an array and my rectangle goes like this. Today's the day for an array display. I can make arrays all day. I make arrays in many ways. Stand back, let's play. Arrays away! Uh oh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. This is me, ten and three, expecting to run out of luck. Sorry! It's all jolly japes when I get into scrapes. I'm always coming unstuck. I'm the clumsiest number you've ever seen. Unlucky number thirteen. Oh. Awesome, dude! Fourteen. Hush, hush! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. I am fifteen, and I am a super special step shaped secret agent. I'm a number with ambition. I'm a number on a mission with a talent that you won't believe. Despite my size, I'm a master of disguise, and I've got a little trick up my sleeve. Welcome! Sixteen. How do? Seventeen here. Seventeen. Eighteen. Nineteen. Hello, hello! Twenty. Very good. Now let's review some vocabulary that will help us to compare quantities. A lot. Look, here we have a lot of blocks. A few. Here I can see a few blocks. A pair. Here I can see a pair of blocks. One, two. A pair of blocks. Let's make a little exercise now. Look at these two groups of blocks. How many blocks can you see here? Very good. A lot. This group has a lot of blocks. How many blocks can you see here? Great! A few! This group has a few blocks. How many blocks can you see here now? 
Excellent. A pair. Here we have a pair of blocks. Let's take a look at these two groups of blocks now. How many blocks can you see in this group? Very good! A few blocks. This group has a few blocks. How many blocks can you see in this group now? Excellent! A lot. This group has a lot of blocks. Wow, look! How many blocks can you see in this group now? Excellent! A lot! This group has a lot of blocks. How many blocks can you see in this group? Excellent! Very good! This group has a few blocks. Well done! Now it's time to work with numbers. We will remember how to do it with the help of a new friend. My friend, Bloxilla. Bloxilla wants to make friends. He is always looking for the bigger number. Let's watch a video to meet our new friend. He will show us how to compare numbers. Are you ready? Let's go! Go ahead, two. I'm bigger than you. <sighs> we should be safe in here. Four is greater than two. <gasps> Go me like four. Like I like square cheese <laughs> in my tummy. Ah! Ooh. No, silly. Oh dear, sounds as if we need a plan. And I think I'll stop looking at the plan. I'm going to be well. Three is less than five. Me like five. Me mean five is greater than three. Me like five. Three is less. Five is greater. Three, but five, one. We're both the same. <laughs> four equals four. You can't eat us now. Me no like to eat you, silly. What? Me like to play with you. Play with us? Five is greater than three, so Blockzilla play with five. What? Play with me! Play with me! Play with me. Play with me. Blockzilla play with number blocks. Three <laughs> is less than four. Three is greater than two. One is less than two. You can count on us with another box. Wow! Blockzilla is so nice and fun. Okay, let's remember this now. Every time Blockzilla finds the bigger number, facing this way, we will use the word greater. In this case, 4 is greater than 1. Now, every time Bloxilla finds the bigger number facing this other way, we will use the word less than. In this case, 1 is less than 4. Hmm. Now, when Bloxilla finds two numbers that are the same, we will use the word equal. In this case, 4 is equal to 4. 
Let's play with Blockzilla and the number blocks now. Ready? Look, here we have the number 1. And here the number 3. Let's think now. Is 1 greater than 3? Is 1 less than 3? Or is 1 equal to 3? Very good! 1 is less than 3. Look at here now. This is number 7. And this is number 4. Let's think now. Is 7 greater than 4? Is 7 less than 4? Or is 7 equal to 4? Very good! 7 is greater than 4. Let's compare these numbers now. This is number 8 and this is number 10. Let's compare. Is 8 greater than 10? Is 8 less than 10? Or is 8 equal to 10? Excellent! 8 is less than 10. Look at here now. This is number 11 and this is the number 14. Let's think now. Is 11 greater than 14? Is 11 less than 14? Or is 11 equal to 14? Very good! 11 is less than 14. Look! This is number 16. And this is number 14. Let's think now. Is 16 greater than 14? Is 16 less than 14? Or is 16 equal to 14? Perfect! 16 is greater than 14. You are doing a great job! Let's compare these numbers now. Here we have the number 17. And here the number 17. Let's compare. Is 17 greater than 17? Is 17 less than 17? Or is 17 equal to 17? Very good! 17 is equal to 17. Look at here now. This is the number 19. And this is the number 17. Let's compare now. Is 19 greater than 17? Is 19 less than 17? Or is 19 equal to 17? Perfect! 19 is greater than 17. Let's make a last exercise now. Look at here. This is the number 20. And this is the number 20. Let's compare now. Is 20 greater than 20? Is 20 less than 20? Or is 20 equal to 20? Very good! 20 is equal to 20. You did a great job! Now is your time to play at home.
Today, we will make our own block Scylla using a sock. I will give you all the instructions in this worksheet. Remember to send me your videos. Have fun playing with Blogzilla and the number blocks. Bye bye! See you next time!